Good afternoon and welcome to the Single Man's Cooking Guide. I'm your host, Alex Lambert, not actually a single man, but I'm going to show you how to make the most out of what you have. Right now we've got a frying pan, we've got some olive oil spray in there because that's all that we had. And uh, it's smoking right now because I accidentally had the burner up too high, but I turned it down. And don't worry, that's not going to be a problem for us today. What we're doing is cooking eggs. A pretty mundane and plain task, but we're going to spice it up and make it a little more interesting than it would normally be. So, I'm going to crack our eggs. Oh, yeah. And, th and there's some shell in there, which, you know, okay, there's a lot of shell in there now, which wouldn't normally happen, but normally I wouldn't be holding a camera while trying to crack some eggs. Okay, there's, there's really a copious, absurd amount of shell in there now. So what we're going to do is put that egg down and get something to fish it out with. That's one, two, and three bits of shell taken out of there. I think there's a fourth, but I'm not sure where it is. Look at that. That second egg went in there brilliantly one-handed. And we are also going to have a third. Once again, risking shell because I'm not used to cracking with one hand. But, you know what? We're single guys, and we make it work. I'm not single. Again, I need to reiterate, I'm married and my wife is in the house and probably listening to this. Now, this is boring, right? We're going to spice it up a little bit, and here's how we're going to do it. A package of Splenda. Outrageous, you say? Not at all. I call these splendid eggs. Alex's splendid eggs. That's the recipe. Grab one of these things here. To kind of, you know what? It's nothing fancy, you know? It's just some fried eggs. It's nothing scrambled. But we're alright, we're doing okay. Now you'll remember I said I had the burner up too high, so I turned it down to four, which is actually a little too low. Where you want it, it's about five and a half. If you want to go ahead and be anal about it. Which I kind of do, and that's fine. Now, I'm debating here some seasonings. I have some seasonings. I don't know why not I want to use them. I am going to use a little bit of pepper. And is that going to go well with the Splenda? Well, you find out. And that's what men do. So, there we go. we got a little pepper in there now. Our eggs are coming along fantastically. This fantastically a word? Does it matter? I don't think so. Let's give a last little pat of that Splenda pack just in case. And in just a couple of seconds, we're going to have ourselves some eggs that are surprisingly a lot better than you might think. Unless there is still some of that shell in there from the first egg, which is entirely possible.